So hello to anything that's in the cabin with us. Anyone? Is there anybody here with us that understands my words? If you do, you can go up and touch any one of the green lights and they will turn red and beep as they were before. Can you do that now? Well, this seems to be the one where if there's anything negative out here, it it's seems to be. Yeah. yeah, right. Charlotte, why are we sleeping in this one? Because I always pick the scariest place or the yeah. most haunted place. That's <laughs> where I like to sleep. It's my happy place. <laughs> <laughs> That was more like one voice, at least. I heard it say we can't. Do you have a name? Can you tell us your name? Did you kill all the flies last year in this cabin? <laughs> I don't know any native words at all, so. I only know hello and like goodbye with respect. Okay. Well, those are good words. Hello is Tansy. <laughs> That's creepy. <laughs> Can you talk to us or I'm going to bring the sage back in here and light it? Uh, you want me to keep the sage out of here? <laughs> that sounded like English. <laughs> yeah. Okay, I won't bring the sage back in if you cooperate. Can you go and touch one of the green lights right now? I'm going to turn off this device so you won't be able to talk to us. Talk, talk. Okay, I'm going to turn off the talking device, and so I want you to say goodbye. If there's anything you need to say to us, now is the time to do it. So I'm taking your voice away. You're going to have to communicate with us another way if you want to communicate with us. Okay, the only thing I want to try in here is we're going to turn off all the meters. So we're going we're gonna to try just no equipment. Oh, now it's really dark. Yeah. So the device I just turned on here, you may not be familiar with it, but it can see you. Can you come stand right in front of it? And if you don't want it to take your picture, then you're going to have to turn it off. Or knock it off. Go ahead, throw it across the room. I'm going to turn back on one meter. We're going to go to another cabin. This might be your last chance to communicate with us. Are you okay with me sleeping in here tonight? If you don't want me to, then you're going to have to light up this meter. Turn it red. I'm not convinced that there's anything here. I don't believe you're here. 
Prove me wrong. Kick Adam. Read the butt. Do it. Do it. Do it. He gives you permission to kick him in the ass. Well, that takes all the fun out of it, though. <laughs> Think if it actually happened, how fast it would be till Adam was in the car and. <laughs> <laughs> no. I don't spook easy. I don't know, getting kicked in the ass by a ghost might scare most people. It intrigues me. I've ever been kicked by a ghost. Been grabbed, well, touched. Do they have shoes? <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> All the pictures I've seen, they kind of just tail off. Yeah. yeah they don't, don't have, have feet. feet. They don't have feet. Okay, pinch Adam. Yeah, bring the meters again. This one that was immediately on. going off. Yeah. Oh, yes, it is. Yep. Yeah. Here we go. Yeah. Do you have a computer in your bag, Charlie? Nope. Turn on. No. No microwave. Nope. Just checking. We're not here to ask you to leave or mess with you in any way. We just want to interact with you. If there's a child here, you're safe. Some of the people in this room are mommies and daddies. Are you a child? Hey, can you go up and touch that light again? How about on a count of three? Show me that you understand me. When you hear the number three, touch the lights. One, two, three. Shot in the distance. Yeah. Yeah. Oh. oh. Um, when I looked at the forecast, it's exactly what I said. By the time we were starting the investigation, all the weather would stop, and then it should start again in the wee hours of the morning. So. Oh. Oh. Mm -hmm. You like the wee hours of the morning? <laughs> Okay, we'll try again for intelligent interaction. If you want to light up the table, the lights, the meter on the table, can you do it right now? Show me that you're listening. This meter right here, I'm going to touch it. Now you touch it. Thank you. Ooh. Okay, let's see if we can play this game. I'm going to touch another meter. If I touch this one, can you now go touch that one? If you play the game right, I have treats. I should just realize how I have that one set on a mattress with the... Sensor set right down at the mattress. It's probably not the best configuration. <laughs> oh, that's oh, yours. Well, oh, thank you for touching another meter. <laughs> Maybe we couldn't get this one to work, so I can't get it to stand up. I hear Adam brought cookies. Lots of cookies. Do you want cookies? Yes, yeah. yeah, so it's hard to tell. That could have been something responding. So let's try it again. I'm going to go up and touch the meter. And as soon as I walk away, you touch it. Show me that you're listening. I bet you see a lot of kids through the course of the summer in here. Do you like to play?
Which bunk is yours? Let's try. If I was a kid and I wouldn't hide from us, I'd go up there. You don't want to play a game with me? You try talking, Charlie. You have a much more approachable <coughs> voice. Do I? Because I also sound like a child? Perhaps. Can you come and talk to us? Wow. Well, thank you. Good job. Now, can you step away from it? Can you make the lights go out? That's really high. Mm -hmm. That is really high. And it's topping out like it would with power. Yeah. Can you step away from that? If you can understand what I'm saying, back away from the light. Can you do that again for us? Don't be afraid of the other light. It can't hurt you. Just the same as before. Can you make the lights light up? So it just flashed and the other one is not registering a number. So it's specific to right there. It likes that one. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Really high. Do you want to turn the K2 off and then back on again? Okay. okay. Sorry for touching your toy. Can you still see it in the camera, Charlie? Yeah. So again, it's like it's lighting up, but the one right next to it isn't light, like we had earlier in the kitchen. So it's you know something touching right there. Is there someone still here with us? Was that someone? No. Right over here. Yeah. Mm -hmm. All right, we'll quiet for a minute. Yeah, because I felt that. Oh. It's so high. <laughs> it is really rare for them to go all the way up to red. Without it being electrical. Um, that one K2 just, or the, uh, that EMF just yeah. keeps shutting off. Like okay. the light, the back light. Okay. So just keep an eye on that one. Yeah, it's just a normal setting. Yeah. And it has a full battery. If there was someone here banging on the cabin, can you do it again for us? Oh. Big K2 flash. <clears throat> Saying welcome can you back. try the one beside it? How about this one? Now, can you stop? Can you please stop the lights? Okay, now I want you to make it stop for 10 seconds. Okay, can you do it again? Oh, 
Because Paul's Paul saying, like, thing. that is yeah. normal. Like, that's usually what we get. That is not what we usually get. Yeah. It's the bright and all the way. That's almost always, when I see that, it's power related. Yeah. And it can't be. Can you light it all the way up to red and keep it there? Almost. A little bit more. disrupt what it's doing but <laughs> this is a good way to see if it's just the meter that it really likes you can come with the meter it's okay I'm gonna put it over here so you can still play with it awesome so again if it was just the position then it would have started setting off one of the other meters over there or something, yeah. but it likes that <clears throat> device. Okay, all the way up to red. Okay, if there is someone doing that, I still don't know if you can understand us. Can you do something else for us to let us know you're here? Can you make a noise, a bang? It's so specific for that device. It's just weird. It makes me almost makes me think that the device is yeah, malfunctioning. Yeah, and that's making me think that it's the K2 that's just... It is malfunctioning, yeah. But then again, usually when these things malfunction, that's not what they do. You know, is it the device malfunctioning, or is it just that it's easier for the spirit to interact with this one? Okay, maybe turn that one off, so they have no choice but to try the other one. If you still want to play with the pretty lights, you're going to have to try the other one. Anybody here? Where do we want to go next? We can go we can back. We go to mine. I'm okay. at six. Okay. 